the, I mean, the one thing that really keeps me going is, um, is, is I have this eternal optimism, you know, like, uh, I mean, I, you know, I can be pessimistic at times, but, you know, it's just like, I just think that, oh, well, especially when things are bad, like I actually work, I function better when I'm at a disadvantage mm. because when I have the advantage, I really don't know what to do because I've never have lived in a time of, of peace and or prosperity. And so it's difficult for me to live with things, you know, even, you know, it's like either I have to seek out the conflict or I have to create it well, yeah, to I, manufacture this, whatever my motivation is. And like, you know, that's weird. I think that's a, I think that's a very, honestly, I don't think it's weird. <laughs> I think it's a, a f- kind of a function of the, of not the universe of this reality. Mm-hmm. I mean, like, if you're going to weight train, or in order to become stronger, I had to weight train. Right. I mean, for, for my lifestyle, I have to impose discipline and rigor on myself right. in order to keep myself straight. It's just you can't. That's how things are. You know, when, you're in, when you have adversity in your life, mm-hmm. if you can use it, this is how you become stronger. You build your character. It's the weight of the universe. It's how you, you grow. Right. It's just a function, I think, of how it is. So I think you're right on by, by doing those things. That's yeah. what keeps you, you. sharp. You. Yeah, I just, you know, but right now it's like weird. Like I, this year was crazy. I, you know, went to, um, did the Sharjah BNL and uh, Sharjah uh, UAE. Went to Nigeria. It was oh, okay, to but before you show. even before you just pass over that so casually, haphazardly, <laughs> you did you did the what BNL? The Sharjah BNL. BNL. And by the way, I don't know if people may not know what a BNL is. I, I'm I'm <laughs> new to the BNL game. This is the fly art shit that we're talking about on this curious podcast. <laughs> A Biennale. What, what, what is that? This is an art exposition. This is a gathering. It's a gathering of artists from usually all over that happens every two years. Right. So like the Venice, the one in Venice is the most sure. famous one, of course. But uh, And this is the, you went to, it's the Sh- Shar- Sharjah. Where's that? Sharjah. It's one of the Emirates, one of the seven Emirates. Yeah, let's, get, um, let's get into geography, man. Yeah. So Don't it you, is. Uh, you went to an Emirates? I've never been to the Emirates. What the, what's that? What's going so on? So, Dubai, you know, Dubai is the place everybody knows. Sure. And then right next to Dubai is the Emirate of Sharjah. And it was curated by uh, Hur al Qasimi, who is the Sheikha of Sharjah and a very wonderful person. Wow. Um, like really wonderful, like, you know, heart, you know, her heart's in the right place. And, but, you know, so she just got all these people together. And what, what I love most about being there, it was there were artists there that I never heard of. And I'm, I, you know, I stay relatively informed about, you know, the goings on in the art world. But she had, she, you know, that was some of those people, those was like their first exhibition outside of their respective countries and it was just i thought that was brilliant because you know like you know art is a market you know and so like you gotta yeah you know there are certain people who people like well this is gonna be the next 30 under 30 or the right top 509 or you know like a lot of hierarchy marketing bullshit you You know know, kind of whatever i mean yeah and that shit never really pans out for me because i think most of these artists suck they have no ambition well no they have ambition but they have no talent and no vision and and no vision that's what you were saying exactly that was like yeah it was like not ambition they do have ambition yeah social climbing so much vision so much ambition social climbing uh with the pressure to put i know i I was going to come up with an interesting analogy but it has escaped me. Sure. Well, <laughs> by the way, you, 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 I've, I've never met someone who's hung out with a sh- a shake. Is it a shake? The shake up. Shake up. Yeah. So is that's that the feminine. The, yeah, the feminine. The 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 masculine is a shake. shake. Is that what we in the past in the eighties called a chic? Yeah, yeah, the chic. Like I slam like iron chic. Iron chic. Jam like a tech with t- correct technique, techniques. You know, so to magnetize me, to <laughs> me, to can't propagatize me. Uh. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> See, this is Nas. This is Nas. <laughs> Nas. Is that, was it halftime? Uh, is that, it ain't hard. To it tell. ain't hard to tell. Yeah, 